Hi guys, it's Nikki and Watson, and today is Stitch Fix Day. Um, we got the box on our porch yesterday, and it was sunny yesterday, it's sunny today, so we are both in a good mood, and we are going outside after this. So, it was a really little box, look at this guy. Um, so we will see, I've cut it open already. Also, I did peek, so I know what's in here, but it's always fun to see things in real life. Um, so first of all, before I jump in, if you've not already watched one of my videos, I am a, I have been doing these unboxings for Stitch Fix for quite a while. I was a stylist for Stitch Fix, and now um, I'm no longer working for the company, but I love getting the fixes, and so I'm going to continue to do the unboxings. So we will jump right in. Oh, and also I asked for color and um, a little more of a boho look than I usually wear, so that's why this shirt is here, I think. Okay, so the first item, let me just see what this is called. It's from Patrons of Peace, the Freyan Cross Front Top. Okay, so I actually, when I got this, when I got this, when I looked at it, I wasn't sure. And I don't know if you can really see the colors right now, but it's got a really nice kind of blue in there that um, I think is going to match perfectly with like denim, which is the main thing that I would be wearing it with, whether it's denim pants or shorts. So um, I love this shirt. If you can see, there's a cross front, so I'll try that on. My only concern right now, honestly, is the length. Again, I think it's gonna be a little too short. Um, so we'll see. But I think excellent color choice. Again, what I had asked for was more of like a cream color solid top with like maybe off the shoulder, just almost a peasant style. Next is another um, interesting shirt. <clears throat> I had seen this one before, and this is called, okay, I don't know what it's called. One second. This is the Umbra Detailed Trim Off Shoulder Knit Top by Montagni, I think. I'm not sure how you say that. So it's off the shoulder, and it has this interesting kind of trim um, and on the arms. And I just have to say, I don't like it. I'm just going to say straight out because I will try it on. But first of all, I know that this type of shirt is going to be hard to wear with a strapless bra. And I'm not against off the shoulder shirts. I, I just don't, I think I just don't like the look of this one. But I'm going to try it on. It could completely shock me. Next is a pair of denim shorts. And these are by Dear John. They are the Lily Distressed Hem shorts. And um, I wanted a pair of denim shorts that didn't have a lot of distressing. And I don't know, we'll try these on. They look a little bit big, but um, I'm excited for these because spring is coming. Okay, this shirt I'm not sure of either, but the colors are gorgeous. So this is another off the shoulder shirt. I think this is by Love Appella. Yeah, it's by Love Appella. And once again, it is the Castiana, Castiana, um, off the shoulder knit top, and the colors are so pretty. So again, it's like a purple and a blue, which is great, again, to, to match with denim in the summer, um, and actually could be dressed up a little bit too. So excited to try this one on. Again, I'm a little concerned because if it works with my strapless, and also it's really loose, and it don't always fit me right when they're that loose. Last but not least, um, a pair of denim, which I did ask for another pair that I could roll up that didn't have any funky hem issues. So um, these ones, actually, I saw, okay, yeah, they do have kind of a frayed hem on the video they showed that, but what, or in the video, when I peeked, they showed that, but um, you can roll them up and they can either show the frayed hem or not. So these are by, I've heard Vigos and Vigos. These are the Jagger Classic Fit Skinny Jeans. So we'll try these on. There is a little bit of distressing. I was hoping more for like this kind of distressing versus an actual thing that could turn into a hole. So anyway, I'll try these on. And Watson, 
Yep, he's already. Okay, seen. and if you guys have not already done so, please subscribe and also um, make sure you use my referral code below. If you've not tried Stitch Fix yet, you will get your first month of styling free and a twenty-five dollar credit um, to use towards your purchase. In addition, I get a credit too. So, um, but you don't have to use mine. You'll get your own referral code when you sign up. But just a great for you way for you to try the service. Okay. Okay, so I actually do love this shirt. I am very self-conscious of like where it hits me. I want it to hit lower. So we'll see about that. But first of all, I just wanna show you how pretty it is. Like the colors are so pretty and I hope you're seeing on camera, it's not see-through at all. Um, I actually have like a, yeah, anyway, it's not see-through. And it does actually have a little bit, I don't know if you can catch it on camera, but there's a slight little puff to the sleeve, but not, not much so um, that's what it looks like it does have the cross front which I'm not completely in love with cross fronts anymore but this one I think is okay um, this is how the back looks this is made out of I'm guessing some kind of rayon polyester blend but it's really pretty and it's lightweight I like it quite a bit so um, my one concern like I said excuse me Watson don't let me get in your way um, is just how short it is so I'm thinking maybe I could try it with a cami or a tank top underneath it. Um, I might do that really quickly, so one sec. Okay, so this is what it looks like with a cami underneath it. Actually, this is a tank, not necessarily a cami. So, <laughs> okay, what's the deal? What's up? I know. We are going to go soon. Okay, so anyway, this is what it looks like. I am obviously, Watson, you, you do have to move, baby. Can you move just a little? I think for a moment here because Watson, do you want to try on the clothes? Because you're kind of taking up the video. Okay. So anyway, this is what it looks like with that underneath it. And yeah, I know. I don't know what I think of it with that underneath it or this tank underneath it. Let me know your thoughts. I love this shirt and I'm going to end up keeping it in some way, shape or form, even if I try to upsize because I think it's so pretty. So, um, Watson and I are gonna to try to work out what his deal is and then I'll try the next thing. Okay, so this is the black Umbra off the shoulder detailed knit top by Montaigne. I really do not know for sure how to pronounce that word. Um, so you can see it has this like border that has got these open. I don't know, we're gonna start this over. So you can see it has this lining both uh, across here and on the sleeves, which I will give it the benefit. Okay, I'll stop. I do like that the shirt tends to stay on their arms a little bit better. So like when I move around, like I don't feel it's popping up, although it kind of is, <laughs> I see. Um, it's a very just simple shirt. It feels like it's a little bit of a stretchy cotton fabric. I can let you know what that is. Um, this is how it looks in the back. It's honestly, I think it fits really well. I think it's a cute shirt. It's just, there's something about this pattern for me. I don't know if it's like a shirt I've had before or there's just something like right when I saw it, I just, I don't love it. So, um, but this is what it looks like for those of you who might like this look. Um, I think it's a really comfortable top and it does have that extra benefit of having um, a better fit on your arms so you can actually move around. All right, I'm gonna go try on the next. Okay, so this is the Love Appella off the shoulder knit top. Um, it has these kind of purple and dark blue. I don't know if you can see that in the color. Um, it's really pretty, I like the color a lot. It is off the shoulder, it is very flowy. Um, so it, it's one of those kind of more loose tops. That's what the back looks like. Um, I really like this shirt a lot. I'm going to just say for a minute that why isn't there a better solution for off the shoulder shirts? Again, I do really like them, but there's two major issues. Number one, there still is no real solution for wearing a bra. I don't care if people can say strapless bras work perfectly. People can tell you to put the pasties on. People can give you all the advice in the world, but it's never comfortable. And I just... I'm shocked at this point in time to believe that we cannot come up with an easy invention so that a woman can be comfortable, yet we're planning like, I don't know, vacations to Mars. I just feel like 
this is an issue that could be solved. Okay, so that's the issue. I love the shirt. I think it's gorgeous. I just worry about like, I mean, this is a little bit better than the black one. I think it's just more like the not loving how a strapless bra feels. But I love this shirt, and so I'm probably going to keep it. And so really, why should they ever solve this problem? Because we all just keep buying the shirts. Okay, I'm off my soapbox, and I'm going to try on the shirt. And last but not least, these are the shorts. They are by Dear John. They have kind of a high-low look, um, but the back is nice and long. And these are um, a little loose on me right now, Qu actually quite a bit. Um, and they're stretchy, so that's probably the only issue because they're very comfortable, and I do like the length of them. So that's what they look like in the back, um, and they're just they're just a little loose on me. But anyway, um, I will go grab my stuff, and we can come back, and I'll tell you what I'm thinking of getting. And yeah, and also Watson did have to leave the room briefly, more for his energy level than mine. Okay. Okay, guys, so um, again, like I said, Watson was not able to join us for the remainder of this program. We're going to go outside together soon. Um, he's already out there right now in his big cage. So um, that's, that's basically our whole yard. But anyway, um, let's go through the pieces. And so I'm wearing two of them. So we'll just start with those. So I've got the Love Appella. This is the Castania off the shoulder knit top, $48. I feel like it's a little bit spendy for what it is, but I, it's the color. I just love the color and it's probably not even fair because I almost would buy anything with color right now, but I think I am going to get this one. And then, um, I'm wearing the Dear John. These are the Lily Distressed Frayed Hem Shorts. These are $58. So yeah, that's a little bit expensive for shorts. I think I just bought a pair at Marshall's, um, for $16 and they're really cute. And they're actually a good brand too. Um, so we'll see about those. And then um, I have to say this Patrons of Peace cross front top. Let's see, this is what I do. Um, thank you. Is my favorite and is also inside out. Anyway, this is my favorite. I don't know why. It just, I love the pattern. I just love everything about it. I would love if it was an inch or maybe two longer, but I think like I am going to try to exchange for a small just to see if that gives any extra length. Otherwise, I'm just gonna keep it because I love it. Okay, so let's see. Um, the next item are these jeans, which are by Vigas, Vigas, or Vigas. And these are the Jagger Classic Fit Luxe Stretch Jean. Really comfortable. A little bit of a darker wash than I was wanting right now, but I actually really like um, the feel of these and can always use a pair of jeans. Okay, so those ones, did I already say, are $68. And then the last thing is this Montang Abra Detailed Off the Shoulder Knit Top, $44. So this is the one item that I just don't love, but I have, I think I have some people that might like this. So I'm probably going to, if I keep everything else, I'm going to keep this shirt. Um, if I do not, I might not keep the shirt. Okay. That's good, Nikki. Um, so anyway, this one, if I didn't already say it, oh, it's $48. But if I buy everything, the keep all discount is $68. So. Once again, I may be forced to keep this shirt, as was my point. Okay, so um, overall, the total price comes to $264, and with the 25% discount, it's $198. So I feel like the items in this box were pretty well priced. Um, there's a couple of things I would not probably buy if it wasn't for Stitch Fix Math, um, but I need the jeans, and I love a couple of the tops, and so I'm actually really... Um, excited and thankful for this fix. Thanks so much for watching and um, I hope you guys have a great rest of the day. I will be filming another video probably in another seven days or so. So have a great week. Talk to you soon. Why Why don't you want to do Stitch Fix? Why don't you? You would prefer to be outside? Is that what you